Like the new car or what? Mate. <laughs> Christ. Go on, it? It's better than the old one, that's for sure. Uh, so yeah, the first question's for me. So was it helpful having a friendly face in Alex when you first arrived? Probably. Yeah, I think the answer is probably is Matty was massive knowing that I was moving to a whole new place uh, in the UK and uh, and then guess knowing that you this is sort of your ends of the woods and you had settled in for a year. It was always good to have someone to turn to. We went for many a coffee and yeah, I showed you around Guildford a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Nando's. Oh, this is a tough one to answer, Alex. How successful was your team at uni? Did you play against any other players that made it pro? Um, yeah, so I like in our final year, we made the Buck Super Rugby final at Twickenham, where we played uh, Hartbury College. Uh, unfortunately, we lost, um, but that was probably the most successful team I'd been in at uni. Um, and then on the f on the other side of that, uh, definitely we played some. Well, we had Aaron Wainwright in our team. Uh, obviously, now in the World yeah. Six Nations squad, uh, played against uh, Seb Negri uh, when he was at Hartbury. Um, don't forget Tom Lauder. <laughs> Tom Lauder as well, Lorde, obviously. Round once, ones around us when we were in yeah, we were once, young freshers. Once an enemy, now a friend. Yeah. But no, yeah. So we we played against some some top players at university, and it's it's good to see them doing so well now for sure. What did you study at uni? Uh, I studied sport and PE for three years. I did. And yourself? Mine was strength, conditioning, rehab, and massage. I'm great now, I'm a rugby player, so I understand my body. I know what's going exactly. on. Exactly. Best ways to recover. Yeah. Etc. Uh, you must have some stories from your uni days. Some obviously can't be shared. Stories from Strictly my. Strictly confidential. From my uni days. Yeah. Maybe the funniest story that we both share is when we were. Alex and I used to love the X Factor, and we used to. Oh, yeah. was to watch them watch the auditions every Saturday after we played rugby on a Saturday and we went to Tesco just around the corner from my house to get treats and I'm walking out of Tesco and he's already outside and he's dying with laughter so I get out of the shop and our head of rugby and his wife are just walking down the street to go on a date We're, and we have piles and piles of chocolate and pizza and fizzy drink and ready for a night in yeah, ready for a good night in and I think that might be one of the most embarrassing stories we've had. Yeah, it wasn't ideal. I think I had like three pizzas that like, stacked on yeah, top of each other. I think. We had a Claire's. Hello? Good morning, Alex and Luke. Oh, guards, is it? No, guards, I've been. Yes. <laughs> guards, I've been stitched we up. We went mate. back to Cardiff for a haircut, I've heard. We, lit, we were just talking about you, Danny. Yeah. How have you got this number? Don't you worry about what we know, well, we, we know everything, don't you? We're heading, mate. Heading London bound. London bound. Uh, Alex, uh, I've put that, that new contract into this nice big car, so now we get to drive around in this rather than this tin can. I, I think he's a bit nervous driving it. <laughs> Danny, it's abysmal, mate. I can't believe I've been tucked up in the passenger seat. Tom, was you passed your test, have you? Yeah. <laughs> First uh, time, baby. So how's it going, Ben Joyce? Yeah, we're loving it. We're Still flying high, Dom's just training hard every day. I'm rehabbing, so got no complaints. How's the injury? Yeah, it's not too bad, thanks. It's a couple of weeks, hopefully. Oh, excellent. Any, um, any sort of late night Tesco's, cream cakes, and uh, you know, like it used to be in the old days? Well, we just told them about that. <laughs> we actually just told we them just that told story. Them. No, not that many bad treats. A couple of pancakes on it, but that's, yeah, you enough. had a game the day before, so yeah, catering enough. for all needs. <laughs> we wish you all the best. We hope it goes well, and uh, obviously it's great to talk to you. You be careful now driving, Alex. We're obviously Always. a bit concerned. But, uh, <laughs> We're all Always. concerned, Danny. Always We're send all our send our luck to the boys for yeah, today. Yeah, have a good one this afternoon. Yeah. I, I can get a feeling Luke's voice, so it's okay then. Just take deep <laughs> yeah. breath, okay, man. <laughs> if you never see me again, guys, then you know why. Right? <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, you have a you have a great time. Love you lots. Cheers, and, Dad. Uh, have a good day. Yeah, yeah, bye, 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 bye. Should we continue as well? Nice yeah, I wasn't expecting that. Go on then, next one. Uh, how has it been with the other lads and team? What is the setup? We moved into a three bed just in in Guildford. We had never met one another before. Uh, I knew of Tom Lorde because of uh, playing against him in Bucks, uh, and I had no idea who Will was. And then when we moved in, we went out for the, the classic Nando's and 
we all got along really well. We still have fun to this day. And plus James, I suppose, he comes around a lot. James Chisholm, yeah, just he, turns up at your door then. Yeah, so I suppose he uh, he counts as a housemate. He makes decisions on the house without paying <laughs> rent nor living there. But he does he does get involved. He brings around a lot of good treats. value and treats. Yeah, yeah he likes so. a good treat, old James Chisholm, yeah. doesn't he? Do you think one day you'll have a tick a blue tick next to your name on Instagram, like Alex does. <laughs> what I a don't, question! I, I don't think I will. I think you actually said to me, like, "Where is my blue yeah. tick?" It's about time I've got one. So let's answer this. Yeah. Let's answer this truthfully. I've got some demands, Instagram. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, no, uh, maybe, maybe one day. Um, Need to take, start taking lessons off Jay Lang. Yeah, Langy does. Get your Insta yeah. profile up there does and if anyone has a nice dog they want to lend to me that seems to have got language booming didn't it yeah if you post a picture of a cute dog then you get loads yeah. of followers yeah. who is the better driver right right here right now i'd say you are the better driver yeah. only purely the fact that i'm still new to this game yeah yeah mate that's okay. you know that's that's a fair that's a fair comment isn't it? yeah let's let's just reinforce that who come to your rescue a few Sundays ago to change a tyre when you, <laughs> you, you punched it in Guildford. Yeah. Yeah, so. Tough time. Yeah. Tough. Well, I enjoyed that. That was yeah. fun, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. Thanks for giving me a lift to work. No worries, man.